Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be sharing with you a makeup transformation from this to this. And I swear this takes only 10 minutes to get done. And this is absolutely perfect for school going girls, college going girls and office going girls out there. And I'll be also sharing with you some tips. Uh, uh, if you want to wear like a makeup on a day-to-day -day basis, those tips will be really really helpful. So yeah, without further ado, let's jump into the video. I already moisturized my face. Uh, now I'm going to use this Nivea Main After Shape Balm as my primer today. Now there is a reason why I'm using this as my primer instead of my regular primers. Because I do not uh, prefer to use a silicone based primer on a day to day basis because silicone based primer may uh, clog your pores and it may cause tons of breakouts and we do not want that so to avoid that you can either use this or your any thick moisturizer or aloe vera gel so yeah please avoid using silicone based primer on a day to day basis and this is also pocket friendly so that is another EA. so i'm just spreading it across on my face and neck now for my foundation today i'm going to be using this wet and wild photo focus foundation in the shade golden beige now there is a reason why i'm using this foundation instead of a bb cream or cc cream now this foundation gives you almost full coverage and this is also pocket friendly if you want to use a bb cream or cc cream first of all it won't give you that kind of coverage and secondly it won't last long so yeah i i will highly suggest you to use a foundation instead of a bb cream or or cc cream on a regular basis also, if you're not a full coverage girl, then you can definitely shear it down and make it like a sheer to medium coverage foundation. And this way, you you won't need a different foundation for like parties or occasions. So I highly suggest you to get a foundation instead of a BB cream. The foundation is on, and I'm going to use the same foundation as my concealer. For that, I'm using my finger my ring finger and I'm just patting the product in now it's time to set it with some powder for that I'm using my Kote Airspan translucent loose powder now no matter what skin type you are dry oily normal combination always set your foundation with some loose powder other than that your foundation won't last long and it 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 won't look good in fact so try to set it with some loose powder now that i have set my interface with powder my face is looking so flat and lifeless now contouring on a day-to-day -day basis can be a little time consuming but you can fix the situation by using a bronzer and for my bronzer today i'm going to use this milani baked bronzer in the shade glow this is my absolutely favorite bronzer now what i'm doing is i'm taking a large powder brush and i'm just swirling the brush like this and i'm going to bronze up my face now you do not have to be precise just bronze of your face and it will give you a nice healthy glow plus some color can you see the difference it instantly made like this side and this side you can totally see the difference and it takes only like two minutes to bronze up your face This bronzer has very nice golden particles, shimmer particles in it and it just makes your skin look so healthy and glowy and you do not have to use any highlighter for highlighting, you know. It gives such a pretty glow. Can you see that? That's what I'm talking about. Now I'm going to do my eyebrows 
never ever step out of your house without doing your brows and I'm not even kidding and for that I'm using my elf eyebrow pencil in the shade medium brown sorry this is deep brown now on a day-to-day -day basis try to use a pencil because it is really easy to use and you won't make any mistake with pencils but if you want to use any brow powder or pomade you can easily make any mistake so brows are all done now mascara is something for me that I do not dare to skip so I need to coat my lashes with mascara and I'm using my favorite essence mascara for that. Look at the difference. This mascara is a bomb I'm telling you. Oh. Mascara is done. If you want to put on a kajal, definitely go ahead and do that. But I won't recommend doing like eyeliner or eyeshadow on a day-to-day -day basis. Now I'm using this Wet n Wild uh, Gel Eyeliner. This is a pencil and I'm just applying it on my waterline as well as I'm tight lining with it. If you want to skip this step, you totally can skip. Now for my lipstick, I'm going to use this Maybelline Color Sensational Matte Lipstick in the shade Touch Up Spice and this color is my favorite. This shade is stunning. And on a day-to-day -day basis, I think these lipsticks are great. This color is great because I prefer to use nude lipsticks on a day-to-day -day basis. And the best thing about a bullet lipstick is you can touch up anytime you want but sometimes it becomes a little bit of messy with liquid lipsticks. I mean you have to rub it off then re reapply again but with these lipsticks it doesn't happen. Now I'm taking a little bit of lipstick on my finger and I'm just going to apply it on my cheeks to have that nice flush of color. Last but not the least, I'm setting my entire face oh, using this e.l.f. makeup setting spray because setting your makeup is really really important. And voila, we are done. How easy was that? So hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, then please hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel. And if you are not following me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter, please do follow me there. All the links will be given in the description bar below. So please do check that out. So see you soon in my next video. Till then bye and take care.